Mr. Speaker, I rise today in support of International Women's Day and to join the countless women across this nation in participating today and, yes, dressed in red, to celebrate our achievements from women across the world in many fields. I stand with the women today to highlight the economic injustices women face, unequal pay, unpaid leave, gender discrimination, and the list goes on. Oh yes, to repeal the health, Affordable Health Care Act. Women are the primary breadwinners. Six out of American women are paid only 80 cents on the dollar, and for women of color like me, 64 cents. But today it is so important for us to say we are faced with a dangerous and the irresponsible repeal of the Affordable Care Act, which will once again mean being a female with a pre-existing condition will take away access to free preventive services like mammograms and cervical cancer screening. You should ask yourself, why are they doing this markup without hearings? You should ask yourself, why should families pay more? Why should those with Fired. disabilities and pre-existing conditions pay more? Why should billionaires benefit more? Stand with us, women, on International Women's Day. I yield back.